Hi, it's Elle from BoostNote. This tutorial is about how to use images on BoostNote. Did you know that BoostNote is not only for techies? You can also upload your images and use it in your note. I will tell you how to do it and where you can find your uploaded images. I already posted a bunch of tutorials on this channel, so check them out if you're interested. I put the link in the description below. Okay, let's get started. Here is my Boost Notes app and I prepared my sample images. To put your image in the note, you just need to drag and drop it to the Boost Note. So let's try it. This is a sample cat. And then sample dog. Once you did that, you can see your images on your note. But not only that, you can see those images in the attachments section. Let's check them out. So click Attachments on the sidebar, and you can see two images I just uploaded. In the Attachments section, you can see all of your images in this storage. And if you do right-click one of them, you can see two menus, Download and Remove Attachment. If you choose Download, this image will be downloaded on your local. And if you choose Remove Attachment, this one will be deleted from this storage. So you will not be able to see deleted image on your note you put it before. Okay, let's remove one of these. You will see this alert if you choose remove attachment. So I will click delete attachment this time. Now I can see only one image here. So if I come back to the note, the cat image should be gone. As you can see, the cat image is gone, but the dog image is still here. For the local storages, you can upload images as many as you want. But for the cloud storage, you have only 100 MB for the basic plan. So please be aware of that. If you need more space for the cloud storage, there is a premium plan you would be interested in. Please check our official website, boostnote.io, for the details. Thanks for watching this video. Please make sure to thumbs up if you like it or found it helpful even a bit. Let us know what kind of tutorials you want to watch in our videos, and we will post regarding that as much as we can. And last but not least, if you found anything inconvenient or good ideas to improve the product, feel free to send us issues and pull requests on GitHub. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one, and have an awesome day! Bye!